the Brexit campaign did focus on hope. Um, you know, its, its slogan that £350 million a week would be available to fund the National Health Service, of course, has been widely attacked as being, in effect, a lie. If you are somebody whose living standards have been in decline for years and are not very high in the first place, it's not very frightening to be told that things are uh, going to get worse for the country as a whole because you think, well, you know, things are pretty terrible anyway. I wanted to write a book that explains uh, the extraordinary phenomenon of voters throughout the rich countries not behaving in the way they were supposed to, uh, or certainly the way the establishment expected them to do. Uh, so I'm talking about those votes for Brexit, for Trump. Some would say the vote for Macron shows uh, extraordinary changes in people's political allegiances, the rise of the far right uh, in Germany, the surge of Jeremy Corbyn in the last British general election. These are all manifestations of people getting very, very angry with the status quo and the people who've run things for years.